What's going on, family? What's going on? What's going down? What's shaking? Welcome to another episode of Super Black Comic Book Reviews by Jonathan Soul. Now, this is a really heavy adult mature content, mature content book, okay? Mature content meaning a lot of violence and some tatas are seen in the comic. And uh, what am I talking about? I'm talking about uh, Southside from Advent Comics. Southside by Advent Comics. Dun, 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 dun. So when I first read this, I forgot I ordered this joint. <laughs> you know what I mean? I, it was the first issue. I always like to see first issues. And uh, and and Cottrell, Tony Cottrell over there, this brother is a prolific writer. He might he write more than people in the Bible. This brother, I mean, I'm still, it's, it's, it's books he's written that I haven't even got to yet. So anyway, so what is Southside? Southside is a uh, about a vigilante in South. East D.C. I think it's Southeast. I don't think it's Southwest. I think it's Southeast D.C. Uh, by the name of uh, of uh, Dalton Malone. Okay, Dalton Malone. Now, when I first read this, I'm thinking this is almost like Wolverine without the claws, kind of a thing. It, it, I got that sense. Um, he does. It's, it's more of a drama. It's not really a superhero kind of a comic. Um, it's not that at all. Um, so we start out with him in a very bad place. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I mean, uh, the brother is tied to a chair, hands and feet, and uh, he's been beaten on severely. And he has a gun pointed. You know, he has a gun to his head, as you can see here. You know what I mean? And so uh, and so, he's not doing too well. But uh, he didn't start. He didn't wake up like this early in the morning. Uh, so we have a flashback as to how he got here. And that's what the bulk of the book is about, the flashback. Uh, by the way, um, I just have to keep, you know, celebrating uh, Advent Comics. This brother, uh, Tony, uh, has been doing comics. He's been publishing comics for 10 years. They're celebrating their 10-year anniversary. And you can tell all of the different uh, titles that he has. And uh, this one right here, Cosmos, I'm actually uh, working on. Uh, getting caught up with Cosmos. I don't have all of the books yet. Uh, number one, I just got. So I got number one, number two, number three. There's an omnibus that comes out um, that I have to work on. So so that's that's something that I'm uh, working on. But so any in any kind of genre that you're interested in, you can get it from Advent Comics. All right. So and and I'm not paid or anything. You know, I'll do this because why well, I want to encourage reading in my African community, okay? African-American, you know, Africans in the diaspora, Africans on the continent. We all need to read because in this technological advanced society, we all need to be reading. So it starts out here, he, he, he goes he go to the flashback. He's fighting some gang members in D.C. about a week ago. <laughs> Everything was fine just a week ago. You know what I mean, and so uh, and so he's you know he's going through and taking these uh, these criminals out or whatever, and it, what he's doing is he's looking for information. That's the way these kind of vigilante things usually start, right? They're looking for information, and so uh, you know he kind of goes through. The cops know that he may have did something, but they can't prove it. You know, kind of a thing. So you know he gets let's go. We see it looks like a Spanish uh, store owner. It looks like he's being uh, accosted by some other people. And so uh, Dalton Malone, um, you know, kind of saves him. Now, it, the book starts out with a quote, and I just I, I, I bring this up because I think it, it kind of lends to illustrate the, the sophistication of Cottrell's writing. There's a quote here from James Baldwin. Um, the most dangerous creation of any society is a man who has nothing to lose. That's James Baldwin. And then, you know, uh, the main character's interpretation of that, sometimes you just got to say, fuck it, Dalton Malone, which is hilarious to me. So so long story short is uh, this guy, you know, uh, this is mature with the language and with the violence, as you can see so far. So he's on a mission to find out something. And as we go on, we find out why. I'm not going to tell you everything because I want you to do what I want you to buy the book. Uh, you can go to adventcomics.com. And you could pick up this title along with other titles that, you know, I, I promote on the program. Um, and so anyway, so, so you know, it, it just shows that the whole neighborhood is kind of going to pot 
kind of a thing. Even the little babies, even the children are uh, acting up and so forth. And so, uh, you know, he kind of goes through, you meet a, you, you see the, a female love interest here and then some, a guy that he's been looking for, he finally catches him. The character design almost reminds me of Bishop from the X-Men and the attitude reminds me of Wolverine, Logan. So uh, it's a nice, it's a nice character uh, that he's developing here. The city, it almost seems like the Wild West in some, in some cases and so forth. So I think it's something that you should, guys should definitely uh, take a look at. I'm not going to show you more. This isn't the thickest book in the world. And, and so I don't want to go too deep, but I definitely want you to keep this on your radar. Um, this is issue number one. Um, I can't wait for the rest of it to come out. I think this may be, this may have some connection to Black Star, which is the other series that I'm, I'm working on collecting. Uh, I just got a uh, Black Star number three. So Black Star number one, Black Star number two, which I reviewed that had like the uh, Infinity guy in it or whatever. And then uh, Black Star number three, um, this has another uh, series. So this is like a, 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 you know, a series of various stories uh, in it. But anyway, all of these are mature themed. So this is like a, you know, mature theme, just like South Side, uh, South Side even more so. So uh, definitely check it out. Uh, go to adventcomics.com, and then you can catch these books and others. And then, of course, you can go to jonathansoul.com, and you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram and uh, iTunes and SoundCloud uh, for more of my content. Mostly, I do, uh, at the current time, I do um, comic book reviews, and I interview comic book creators. And I also have a little news show that I do called Nonfiction. All right? Love you guys. Hope our dreams come true. Peace.